Paul's third missionary journey was a remarkable chapter in his life, filled with adventures, trials, and divine interventions. Setting off from Antioch, he embarked on a mission to strengthen the churches he had established and share the good news of Jesus Christ with new regions. It was a journey that would lead him to various cities, where he would leave an indelible mark on the lives of countless individuals. Let us now follow Paul's footsteps and explore the vibrant tapestry of his third missionary journey. Paul first traveled through the Galatian region and Phrygia, strengthening the disciples in these areas. As he moved forward he arrived in Ephesus, a bustling city known for its grandeur and pagan worship. Here, Paul would spend a significant amount of time engaging in debates and sharing the gospel with both Jews and Greeks. His teachings shook the foundations of the city, leading to the conversion of many and the emergence of a strong Christian community. During his stay in Ephesus, Paul performed numerous miracles, demonstrating the power of God to the people. His handkerchiefs and aprons were used to heal the sick and evil spirits were cast out by his heartfelt prayers. These extraordinary acts of divine intervention left an indelible impression on the people, further solidifying their faith in Christ and distinguishing Paul as a vessel of God's grace. From Ephesus, Paul continued his journey to Macedonia and Achaia regions where he had previously established churches. His aim was to encourage and support these congregations, building upon the foundation he had made during his previous visits. His letters to the Corinthians, for example, were written during this period, offering guidance and addressing various concerns within the church. While journeying through Greece, Paul encountered both opposition and triumph. In Athens, the intellectual hub of the region, he engaged in philosophical debates with the learned scholars of the time. With wisdom and conviction, he proclaimed the gospel amidst the statues of Greek gods, presenting a radical alternative to the prevalent idol worship. Though some mocked, others were intrigued, and a few even embraced the message of Christ. Paul's journey continued through various other cities, including Corinth where he spent a significant time teaching and strengthening the believers. He also faced opposition and had to defend his faith against false accusations. However, he remained steadfast, enduring hardships and persevering in his mission to spread the message of hope and salvation. As Paul neared the end of his journey, he faced immense hardship, including shipwrecks, imprisonment, and public trials. Yet, through it all, his faith remained unshakable, and he continued to exude hope and optimism. His unwavering trust in God's plan sustained him in even the darkest of times, inspiring others to find strength in their own trials. In the final leg of his journey, Paul returned to Jerusalem, knowing the trials awaited him. His arrival sparked controversy, and he faced persecution from both Jews and Roman authorities. Despite the challenges and warnings, Paul remained steadfast in his commitment to the gospel, even if it meant sacrificing his own freedom. Paul's third missionary journey was a powerful testament to his unwavering dedication and love for Christ. His tireless efforts in spreading the good news, despite facing immense challenges, continues to inspire believers to this day. Through his encounters, teachings, and divine interventions, Paul played a significant role in building the foundations of the early Christian church, leaving behind legacy that endures through the ages.